Y'all get ready? Yes, you get Hell ready. We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, it's your girl T. So I got some Cardi B tea for you guys, okay? So if you guys don't know, this entire situation is a hot damn mess and it's just getting crazier and crazier as the damn days have gone on, okay? So before I get started, make sure you guys check out lovelytea.net or go on to Amazon for all your tea sipping needs. I have a wide variety of teas and accessories for you guys so you guys can sip with me here on my channel, okay? So if y'all don't know, Cardi B and Hennessy Carolina once again got into one of Nicki Minaj's barbs called Keisha Coltslaw. Okay, so this entire situation is a hot damn mess. I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this back and forth between her and Nicki Minaj's barbs. Y'all go ahead and check this out. Then I'm going to read to you guys the part that got her in the most trouble. Go ahead and check this out. All right, so y'all just saw that entire illiterate ass back and forth. So I'm going to read to you this post that's going viral right now, okay? So right now, um, what happened is that after they went back and forth with Keisha Coleslaw, another person came on there and they had replied back to Hennessy Carolina and Cardi B. So Hennessy Carolina says, annoying, babe, ha, ha, ha. Then I love Vari94 says, keep posting and deleting. You and your sister will never be directed to Nikki. Will never be directed to Nikki. Y'all know where y'all stand. I like you a lot, but if you're not going to add her, stay shut, babe. At at Hennessy Carolina at I am Cardi B. And then Cardi B comes and she says, at Keisha Coatslaw, fuck it at, I'm dropping my address, is I'm in Atlanta in Mean Studios. What's up? Pull up, you claiming I'm pussy. I'm giving you a location, any of you in ATL, because I'm here. I dropped my baby so I can fight right now. Honey. Now, y'all just heard me try to struggle to read that literate ass bullshit. Y'all also saw the back and forth between Cardi and Keisha, okay? So basically what's going on now is that some of these barbs threaten to call CPS on Cardi B and it really has her spooked and she's really upset. So now, so since the barbs had threatened her by calling CPS, she's been trying to post videos of her baby and post videos of her singing to her daughter. This entire situation is a hot damn mess. Y'all go ahead and check out these posts what the barbs had to say by calling CPS on her. Y'all check out what Holly Scoop had to say and then y'all check out these videos that Cardi B posted. Check this out, I'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary. Fed you, I bathe you, I just fed and bathe you, and you not sleepy. Baby, my baby, my baby, oh no, oh no. Culture, do you love me? I'm your mommy. I remember when I had you with Sani, and I burp ya, and I need ya, and I die for ya, like older. Do you love me? I'm my mama, mama, mama. I'm my baby, mama, mama. I love you, what you want you. I love you, what you want you. Want you. you want me. You want me. I love you. A source reported to Hollywood Life that although no one from CPS has contacted Cardi yet, just the thought has her seriously shook. The source said, quote, this has shaken her to her core. Just the idea of the authorities coming to do a check is scary. Um, yeah, being a new mom is hard enough without some randoms making threats to call the authorities. Like, get a life, people. With these threats still out there, Cardi is doing the most to show that she is, in fact, a great mom. She took... Honey, that CPS call got her nervous as hell, and I don't blame her. And this is why I say that Cardi B needs to log off the internet, okay? And obviously, she's suffering from postpartum, and she's gone through a lot. And at this point in time, she needs to stop putting herself in a situation that's going to allow trolls to get to her. This Keisha Cole slot chick is literally about 15 years old. The fact that Cardi B and her grown-ass sister getting into it a damn teenager says a lot about their mentality. 
They are literally going back and forth with this child on Instagram, on Snapchat. The girl has 13 posts and 570 followers. How the fuck did y'all find her when y'all have over millions of followers? You have millions of people praising you every day, showing you love every day. But in the same token, you guys will turn around and go back and forth with the one person that does not like you, the one person that eggs you guys on or that gets under your skin. Both Hennessy and Cardi B need to grow up. This is just looking sad at this point. Because she's going to say the wrong thing on social media and these people are going to end up calling CPS on her and they're going to pay her a visit and she does not need that, okay? At the end of the day, she did not mean that she dropped her baby on the floor. She means that she had her baby and that if she needs to, she'll fight, okay? The only thing in my personal opinion that Cardi B needs to be worried about is once again breastfeeding her child and taking care of her child to the best of her ability and stop getting on the internet and going back and forth with random fans and random haters. It just makes no sense why she continuously allows herself to get stressed, pressed, and played by the damn barbs, okay? So now in other Cardi B news, just wanted to let you know that Bruno Mars has finally found somebody to replace Cardi. As we all know, Cardi B is unable to go on tour with Bruno Mars, and I told you that she would not be able to do that months ago, and then she confirmed it last week. So now Bruno Mars has found a group of people to fill her spot, and I want to go ahead and share this with you. Y'all go ahead and check out this video right here. What's up guys, it's Bruno Mars coming to you live with a special announcement. If you are wondering who's joining me on the 24 Karat Magic World Tour finale, let me show you. Hit him with the Photoshop. Who's coming with us? Tell me if it's you, you, you. Sierra coming with us on tour. Who else coming with us? Uncle Charlie. Who else we got coming? Oh shit. I'm booed up. I'm booed up. LMA coming with us on tour. Who else we got coming with us? All the We've come to the end of the road. Boys to men coming with us. 24 K Magic World Tour finale. It's gonna be a party. Let's go! All right, so you guys just saw that Bruno Mars video. So congratulations to Sierra. She's going to be the main person taking over for Cardi B. Boys to Men will also be there as well. So this tour definitely sounds exciting. I definitely love how Bruno Mars put this together and how he sung everybody's names and, you know, he sung their music and everything else. So I think his tour is still going to go on without a hitch. Bruno Mars has a huge fan base. It would have been nice if Cardi B could have gone on tour with him. But being that she's not able to, I'm glad that he was able to find an alternate. So anyways, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know your thoughts on this entire crazy situation. Once again, concerning Cardi B getting into it with the barbs and not being hella nervous and hella scared because they're threatening to call CPS on her. Do you feel like Cardi B just needs to log off the internet, take a break, focus on her child, and stop getting into it with random strangers? Or do you feel like she has a right to defend herself? And then Four, also, are you guys three, here for Sierra going on Bruno Mars tour and taking Cardi B's place? Do you think that's a good fit? Do you think that's a good replacement? And then will you be going to the Bruno Mars tour when it comes to your city? So let's go ahead and get the discussion popping. And go ahead and leave a comment. All right, deuces. <laughs> hey, you guys, it's your girl T, and I hope you really enjoyed that video. If you want to know more about my look of the day or if you want a way to contact me concerning advertisement and sponsorship deals, definitely feel free to click my description box. There's plenty of information in there. Please stay tuned for the next video. Talk to y'all later.